Welcome to Up to Speed, I'm Katie Hargett. The Verizon IndyCar Series is known for its variety of racetracks, and this week the drivers head south to the Augusta of racetracks, Barber Motorsports Park. This will be the third different type of track drivers have competed on in 2018. From the streets of Long Beach and St. Pete, a short oval in Phoenix, and now the flowing turns of a permanent road course. Barber Motorsports Park has provided some of the best battles, like this one between Graham Rahal and Simon Pagano for the win in 2016. But this is Joseph Newgarden country, and he's come away the winner two of the past three years. The wait is over. Joseph Newgarden is an IndyCar race winner. Congratulations, buddy. First win here, nice job. Whoa, baby, that was awesome. First win in Penske colors for Joseph Newgarden. He's done it again in Barber. Man, that was fun. Got the first one together, thank you. Yeah, boys, awesome work. Speaking of variety, the top six drivers in championship standings now represent six different teams. And after scoring both the pole and the win in Long Beach, Alexander Rossi now leads the championship standings for the first time in his career. During last year's Honda Indy Grand Prix, Rossi started 18th and charged through the field to recover with a fifth place finish. And ladies, you're going to like this news. Channing Tatum will be the Grand Marshal for the Honda Indy Grand Prix of Alabama. I'm Katie Hargett and now you're up to speed. Watch the Honda Indy Grand Prix of Alabama, Sunday, April 22nd at 3 p.m. on NBCSN.